welcome to my channel dear viewers i want to say all of you uh, mainly those of students who uh, who are facing some problem in mathematics and uh, then comment uh, to my comments box when you follow the videos and send me my messenger your problems and i will try to solve it in times okay in my channel i am posting approximately 500 videos for the subject wise uh, if you play the playlist and uh, then you see your uh, the subject and actually um, this is this channel is for of the, those of the students uh, who want to uh, appear 11 12 and also for the uh, who want to appear for the competitive exam like joint iit and also for the btech and bsc okay uh, follow them uh, follow my channel <clears throat> okay thank you see here is the problem is here limit x tends to infinity x tends to zero uh, cos x minus one and cos x minus e to the power x okay cos x minus e to the power x and divided by x to the power n and now find n and which is a finite non-zero number it may be either one two three four uh, which is uh, valid for this question okay now follow the solution here i here my uh, need to the expansion for cos x and also e to the power x now the expansion of cos x that is need to learn okay so this is one minus x square by factorial two x to the four by factorial four minus dot dot two infinity same as e to the power x is equal to one plus uh, x by factorial one x square by factorial two x cube by factorial two okay so need to know the expansion see this is your solution limit x tends to zero expansion of cos x is one minus x to the power two by factorial two x to the power four by factorial four okay and this is here minus one and also cos x the expansion is here 1 minus x square by 2 factorial 2 x to the power 4 by factorial 4 okay and minus the expansion of e to the power x is here 1 plus x by factorial 1 x square by factorial 2 dot dot to infinity and this is second bracket and whole divided by x to the power n and that is equal to limit x tends to zero c so one one cancel so take common x square this is here minus one by factorial two plus x square by factorial four okay now one one cancel and uh, this is here x so minus x by factorial one x square no 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 and this is here x square by factorial 2 minus 2 x square by factorial 2 minus x to the power 3 by factorial 3 this is here 4 so x to the power 4 and next x to the power 4 are cancelled okay dot dot and here is x to the power n okay now uh, when uh, we want to get here a integer okay now sorry uh, this is now uh, get a uh, finite value so what will be the least value of x uh, least value of n so if we take common x so therefore uh, here is degree of n is cube so now we got here 1 by factorial 2 x square by factorial 4 okay and this is here take common x okay so that's a 1 by factorial 1 and this is here x by factorial 1 this is x square by factorial 3 okay and x to the power n so so what is the least value of n least value of c here is 3 
so here is n okay so now write at the right here uh, 0 and this is here x to the power uh, x to the power 3 minus n and that would be 1 by minus 1 by root 2 x to the power 4 by factorial 4 okay and this is here minus 1 by factorial 1 minus x by factorial 1 minus x square by factorial 3 dot dot so see if we put here 0 then we get uh, the formation here is a, um, a real number um, and we get so it would be here bad value this is n and this is 3 so x minus sorry this is here n minus 3 uh, equal to 0 so n equal to 3 answer is 3 okay so answer is 3 Actually, I am wrongly written and uh, this is would be a x to the n minus 3, okay. So, then n minus 3 equal to 0 actually. Okay, I think all of you better understood. Follow my video. Video. If you enjoyed this video, then share this video to all of your friends and also subscribe my channel. Thank you.